hello guys welcome back to my channel and in this video we will be talking about Ye Wes and Bianca Sensori still being haunted by the paparazzi no guys earlier we did a we did a video wherein we talk about Ye taking Bianca to dinner the paparazzi was there it appeared as though they were keeping their distance but evidently based on a clip that I'm seeing I was wrong the paparazzi they're not keeping their distance and at this time their actions are very very dangerous to Ye and Bianca's well-being. You might be asking how is that? How so? I'm gonna show you guys a little clip so that you guys can analyze this for yourself then I'll come back with the rest of my commentary and in case you don't get it I'm going to tell you guys what I mean by that. And not just me, social media as well is saying the same thing. But let's get into it. Don't worry, man. Do you have anything to say about the lady, the instinct? It's 20. Now, guys, I want you to look at this section. Do you see how Bianca is covering her face? Not because she wants to hide from the paparazzi, but because the flash of the camera is so blinding. And in this moment, many people realize that there's actually a lot more danger to what they are doing than how Ye West initially expressed many people are now outraged by this clip because they're saying how was he able to drive after all that flashing light in his eyes it seems as though he was a bit disoriented i mean from not being able to see clearly after those camera flashing lights i don't want to hear any excuses for that flashing light there's absolutely no excuse i understand that that's their job and all of that but i think that you know try to take the photos some distance away to ensure that the flashing lights are not so you know focused on their eyes and even when he was in the car i think that at that point they should stop you know doing that flashing light do some videos if you have to and have some other light mechanism because that is seriously dangerous and also to address the issue of ye not opening the car door for bianca just imagine what would have happened if you opened that car door for bianca the, they were in a mode where it's like basically the word i want to say is basically get to the car get to the car i forgot the meaning of that right the name that i want to use the word that i want to use but so they were just being urgent in getting the car getting in the car and getting out of that space if he had gone to the door opened the car door for bianca to get in ensures that she gets in close the car door it would have given the paparazzi more time to bombard them i also see this a lot with kim kardashian Oftentimes, once the paparazzi are on the scene with the flashing lights, the security does not open the door. Kim herself opens the door, gets in, ensure the kids are in, and then she quickly rushes in. This is very much unhealthy. Again, let me reiterate, I understand that this is your job and we also benefit as content creators. But at the same time, we want everyone to be safe because we want to talk about them next year, the year after that, the year after that. I don't want to hear that anyone is having anyone has had a car accident because of paparazzi. That would be too devastating to their loved ones, their families and friends. And as such, I genuinely believe that there needs to be some protocol in place, some law in place you know new gears new equipment something something needs to be done about this and i want to share this with you guys because i see many people talking about it and i'm like hold up this is so true and now people are saying listen he has to be quiet because he doesn't want anyone to dehumanize him again because he's now being reported um being investigated for robbery and he cannot afford to have another instance of that so it's like what the hell let me wear my mask keep my mouth shut can you imagine you have no say i mean over people taking photos of you 
that's just crazy that's like a robbery i think we all need to do better but guys i want to hear from you because this is pretty interesting and at first you know many of us were like oh my god he needs to open the car door but after looking into it and the sense of urgency and how quick they have to you know get out of there get in the car drive off to ensure that their lens their eye lens are at um, ease from those flashing lights you truly understand why he didn't go to her side open the car door ensure she gets in close it then goes around to his side that would have given the paparazzi way too much opportunity and leverage to be in their faces more so i really truly understand that now but i want to hear from you guys let me know what your thoughts are because it's crazy while you're at it give this video a big thumbs up share if you care and remember if you haven't subscribed as yet go ahead hit that subscribe button thanks for your time stay safe sweet bless see you all next time bye guys